We help growers grow, try to work against all the problems. We work with growers on the farm as far as uh, fertility programs go, chemistry, so disease and insect control. Razor tracking uh, for us is you know related to our fertilizer business, uh, the delivery of that. I, mean, I think there's 60 plus pieces of equipment here at CHS. We typically daily are trying to keep track of 10 to 15 tenders and probably about 10 spreaders. We rent out pull type spreaders and, and tender units as well as liquid uh, trailers. And in the past, they've been misplaced. And by misplaced, typically that means one customer has let it go to another, his neighbor, uh, thinking that uh, we would know that. And then it, it takes several days for us to identify and track down where the piece of equipment has gone. I am a custom applicator. I spray the fields. As an applicator, I use it to track my tender truck where it's at we're spraying, they're getting water, coming back. We're moving around to different fields. One time, the guy wasn't there. Found him on razor tracking, just watching him go up and down the street. He couldn't find me, so I called him and could follow him and tell him exactly where to turn and how to find me. Before razor tracking, Ryan and I would have to call each other, and it would take 30, 60 minutes to figure out logistically where all these tenders need to be moved on a daily basis. The 32 spreaders that we have, 14 bumper pull tenders, 13 semi-trailers, 17 thousand gallon liquid buggies, five 550s, three liquid semi-trailers, three floaters, four sprayers, two 20-foot flatbed bumper pull trailers, two 16-ton straight trucks. Knowing every time an important vehicle goes in or out, that's important to me and, and helps our business. The asset uh, tracking piece of Razor has been huge for us as far as, as far as being able to identify where pieces of equipment are at all times. This job and, and the way that we do our deliveries is different than a lot of other industries. You know, we're not going to an address on a map. You know, we're going to somewhere in the middle of nowhere, you know, around a corner, by a barn. You know, razor tracking eliminates the long instruction list that you would generally have to give somebody uh, to find a piece of equipment, to pick it up, to move it, to do maintenance on it or, or whatever. Typically, you know, we were finding where without razor tracking, uh, there was hand maps that were provided, but a lot of times the customer would would move the piece of equipment. If that hadn't been reported, then you'd have a, a tender truck uh, running around the countryside basically looking to where it was supposed to match up with its destined load. When we're not out in the field, usually end of the season, we're the guys that are going up, picking up all the equipment. We got over 90 pieces of equipment spread out at possibly 150 miles. So knowing exactly where each and every one of them are, it makes our job so much easier. The savings in that, just that time management of being able to get the tender equipment where it needs to be, when it needs to be there, probably on average we figure saves us around $1,000 uh, to $1,200 a month just in labor. It's hard to put a value on it between the uh, increased efficiency and you know decreased stress level. I, I think it's well worth it and you should certainly look into it if you're trying to keep track of any equipment.